Today, I'm investigating one of the most controversial businesses on the internet. I'm meeting with Tony, who is an OnlyFans manager making over $130,000 a month. And what he told me about this business was shocking. You have a guy who's yeah. messaging other guys yes. for 18 hours a day. Yes. <laughs> it's a guy that it's married, three kids, and wants the divorce to see my mother. Boom, sell, boom, sell, boom, sell. Oh, you want daddy to send you some money? So I had one guy that spent in a day more than 5K. Some people told me, but you're a bad guy. No, he's addicted, he's obsessed. How would you explain, what do you do? Um, how to say it? Uh, I'm a normal agency of marketing, but in the niche of OFM. And the thing is that we only help girls to have more freedom, to have more money in their accounts of OnlyFans. And that's it, that's our work, like grow, growing up their accounts and making more money. What does a typical day look like for you? The typical day, first of all, like what we're gonna do is to get one of the phones that we have uh, can you pass one, please? And what we're gonna do is to post some videos in IG or wherever. We can see one account of our models. You can see here some guys speaking, all the stuff, blah, blah. Hey, I'm in love with you, you're so beautiful. <laughs> uh, the job of uh, the woman. What we do is right now posting the videos for doing the marketing and for getting some subs from like other girls. Here you can see like only one girl this week like $800 of a new one, okay? So it's like 3K that she's gonna do and I'm gonna take like 2K dollars more from one girl that is starting from like what? Two weeks? Yeah. Two weeks started with us and is doing right now $800 per week. You can see here that it's one guy that spent 1.7K in I think three months, something like that. Here you have new subscribers, all these guys that one spent here $200, this $200 also, his uh, $100, $200. Also we have one guy that spent more than 3K in this goal. 370 was for this guy, this guy only, in one day. So what is he getting when he's spending $370? His fantasy. <laughs> That's it, brother. So a lot of these guys are messaging these girls on OnlyFans, but it's not actually the girls talking to them. No, maybe it's like this guy. It's it's a guy from Nigeria. Was near Nigeria, one city from there, Africa. Yeah, and it's a guy that normally in his like uh, normal job is gonna get like fifty dollars something like that. And with us, it's gonna get like five hundred dollars minimum every single month. But it's working so hard, like eight hours per day. Boom, we start eight dollars. Okay. Boom, we start ten dollars. Okay. Boom, eight dollars. Okay, eight dollars. Okay, ten dollars. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Five dollars. Another fifteen. Another fifteen. Oh, tip of $50, $20, $20, $20. So, yes, she made only like one case speaking with some guys with pictures of food. And that's it. <laughs> so it's no news, no touching, no, no nothing. Fit. And you said, how many girls do you have? Uh, 16. 16? Yeah. And are they all kind of like this or are some of them more no, like, exploitive? Sometimes there's a niche like this one, the fit or the anime or like these type of things that are more difficult to maybe do the marketing, but are more easier to get the money because it's like a fetish, you know? So it's going to be more easier to get the money, but normally it's influencers or I don't know teachers of something maybe a step mom something like that so you have a team that is doing everything for you like you're not you're not messaging yeah that's for it any of the girls. whatever it is uh, right now is for 544 it's starting in three hours uh, Joseph yes. with this girl because we have these four hours that 
doesn't have that much audience, but the audience is good. Uh -huh. So it's working like 18 hours per day, but the other six hours is more chill. Just messaging. Yeah. You have a guy messaging guys. Uh, no, I'm never messaging. No, but you have a guy who's yeah. messaging other guys yes. for 18 hours a day. Yes. <laughs> That's it. That's it. And yeah. how many people do you have doing that? Is he just the one? Uh, no, 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 no. Normally it's uh, three guys per girl chatting only. And normally it's one eight hours, other one eight hours, and other one eight hours. So like that is the 24 hours, seven days. So she's always available. Yeah, 24 seven. Yeah, I want that. Here you have. Oh, you want daddy to send you some money? She was like, oh yeah, of course. And she put the van of the model, boom, $400. That's it. And how much are you paying the chatters? Depends, depends of each, because normally maybe can be five, eight dollars per hour, or can be a commission of all the profits from the messages. That normally can be five, seven percent, something like that. But depends of the models, because it's not the same, the five percent of 2K, the five percent of 200K. And how much is the girl, the, your biggest girl making? My biggest girl, right now, I'm not doing that much with her, but I was doing with her 120K dollars, and I was getting like a profit of 75K. A month? Yeah. It's a lot. Yeah, I know. <laughs> a girl, <laughs> one girl, yeah, I know. My first month, I was doing 2K, when I was like knowing zero. Mm. Right now, maybe it's, more difficult to get a woman. It's not difficult. You saw right now one guy that in one day spent 370. Is it difficult to make 2K? No, it's not. It's only 10 motherfuckers and that's it. Right. <laughs> 10 guys. Mm -hmm. And also I had one guy that spent in a day, in a day, more than 5K. And also in a month, more than 20K. One guy. So it's- And you said, so you take 70%? Yeah, 70%, 60, 50 if she's a good one, and that's it. And just why do you think that the girls come to an OnlyFans management rather than just doing it all themselves? Because maybe they are not doing money, or because they are doing money but they are not free. Like they don't have freedom. The point of the agencies of OnlyFans at the final of the day is to get more money for them and to get more freedom for them also. Because if she's working all the time, you're not doing a shit. So you're a bad agency. What are the type of guys that, are, that would be spending this much money? This guy, Kyle, it's a guy that it's married, three kids, and wants the divorce to see my model. He's prom uh, promising, I'm gonna get divorced to be with you and all this stuff. And he's never actually talked to the real girl? No. And are they usually, do they usually have money or is it guys who are spending like the last money in their bank account? It's a guy that has money, but there's also guys that are maybe 35 years old, something like that, and goes to the bank, hey, I need for a project, money, and all the stuff, and it's for like paying my model and that's it. Some people told me, but you're a bad guy. No, he's addicted, he's obsessed. He do it because he want. I didn't tell him, hey, get in debt. So you don't, there's no part of you that like feels bad for these guys or anything like that? All right, so now we are at a photo shoot that is gonna act as a promo for some of the events that Tony is throwing. So we've got a bunch of models here, got like three photographers, it's uh, very interesting. All the things that are so expensive here, because if not, it's gonna be broken. Only the table, it's 15K. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope that no one is getting drunk in the pool. <laughs> That's the only thing that I want. I don't know what the f is going on, but I love it. Would you say this is an easy business to start? I think that is the most easiest. Like, you're playing with addictions. And it's not about is the most easiest and is the most difficult. I don't mind if it's difficult or it's, or it's not. It's more about it's giving me good money, it's giving me freedom, it's giving me like 
the things that I want in my life and the things that I want as a man to have? Yes. Let's do it. This is the girl that was making the most money. She was making like 40k per month each month. We used to work with this girl, but we didn't work more only because she wanted to be a mom and all the stuff. Like, it's not a problem, but you feel when you have 75k less in your bank account. <laughs> it's like, f off. Now, new models, more money, that's it. How many of the girls that you have under your management are doing sexual stuff? All. All of them? Yep. Okay. But not all of them are doing new or yes. are they? They are? Okay. One wasn't two months ago, but she was like, hey, f it, uh, there's a lot of money there. Let's do it. I was like, if you want. And she was like, yeah, I'm 100% sure. Okay. This is something that's like on autopilot once you get everything set up, like you get all the employees set up, you get the girls set up. Is it like, are you just chilling every single day? You're chilling, like you can see it today. Like I worked. No. <laughs> no. I didn't see it. <laughs> yeah, like, I work more in the events than in the end of the And how much did you make today? Uh, I don't know. I think like 2K, something like that. We're sleeping. We make more money than where we are awake. That's the thing. The $500 with this girl was when we were sleeping. She was getting up and uh, telling me, Tony, you know the new girl? Yeah, what happened? We made $500 with her. Oh, Joseph, good job. Help, my mom is on OnlyFans. She's got more fucking followers than a K-pop band.